All right, I'm just going to do a quick little intro here. Um, I want to thank you all for watching, and uh, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, we're almost to our goal of 1,000. It keeps going up and up and up, faster and faster. So if you enjoy the video, subscribing is really the best thing you can do, and it's free. So hope you enjoy the video. Welcome back to my friendly neighborhood. Um, we just got this mask thing or something. Velvet mask could have been used in a play or a horror movie. Yeah, I guess so. Um, so I don't know where that goes or what it's for, but <coughs> we're going to take it with us. Um, so we're in the office building. I don't have a map for it yet, so just kind of... Wandering. These little Elmo sounding things are disturbing. <laughs> Who did they get to do the voice for that? Because that's awesome. And terrifying at the same time. <laughs> so I don't think I can get out of the office right now. I think my course of action oh is this where the oh those are just parts of the I thought it was one of those secret tapes and I thought maybe I could break it open cause man I wish I had a well this goes up I don't want to go up yet Because I can go up, like, manually, not in an elevator. See, that responds on time. Why can't my gun firing? I get it if it's a, like, rate of fire thing, but still, like... The fact that I can't manually shoot it kind of sucks. I'll get used to it, but for that's okay for games like Resident Evil, like in the third person with the tank controls and everything. Like, but for first-person shooter, like you got to be able to just shoot however you want. Oh, the punctuation. Is it a grenade? Because that's what it seems like. There's another mask in here. Okay, so I literally don't have enough spaces. I'm just going to have to use up my... But it's still not going to go, because I need to move stuff. Gonna ambush me, huh? Oh, they are coming from both sides, aren't they? Are you here to watch a newest episode? 
Okay. Okay. It's locked. Dang it. And I used my last health thing. See, I don't need the... I mean, they wanted me to use the grenade, but I don't need to. Still don't have a map. Which kinda sucks. Alright, now let's go upstairs. Like, upstairs, upstairs. Toolbox. Really? Not a single one. Because I have two punctuations. I don't need... I don't use grenades in games like this. Oh. Well. Where's the, oh, I don't have a... had a box room. Is it this way? I think it was this way. No, I'm not. Leave me alone. Here we go. I really just gotta... I wish there... Is there a way to, like, get a bigger bag? Because that would be cool. I need to heal. Because if I don't heal, I'm going to be screwed. Let's try this again. This time with inventory space. What is this thing? have to run from it. It's locked from the other side. That's not cool. Alright. 
At least I got out of there. What the heck was that? <laughs> Something mad. And I just used up like all of my ammo. Oh, but I'm finding some. Filling up again, I guess. I guess it, that thing can probably be in here too. So this is like doom aiming rules. As long as you're pointed in the general direction, you will hit. Without crosshairs, how are you supposed to know? Man, I want a map so bad. Aha! Oh. Almost missed something. <coughs> Great, so it's also showing me what's locked and what's not. Are you? I don't think so. I'm leaving. Sorry. See ya. Bye. Don't like it. It's a diamond key. Wow, she almost got me. Oh, well, I guess I used up a spot. Need ammo, for sure. Kitchen. Monsters. Press the bell to start. When it's your turn, either draw a card or play a card to move that many spaces. First to end wins. If you land on Norman, draw a card. Junebug is wild. If you start your turn on Junebug, immediately play the top card of your deck. Poor Leonard is slow. If you're on Leonard, you can only play one. Uh-oh, if you land on Goblet, you lose. It's still missing a piece. Oh, and he's got the key. So I've got to beat him to... The safe has been installed to keep vulnerable items out of the hands of the neighbors. I don't want to include the combination here in case some of them can read, but let's say it'll help if you see the flip side of things. 
Okay. So there's health. Looks like something's missing. What? Okay, I guess I'll figure it out. But that gives me the code, right? Yeah, something's missing, so... Three, six, one, five, two, three, four, six, five. So I need to find things, I guess. I got a few things to find for in here. So I probably need to find like a game piece or something for that. Oh, this one, I unlocked it. Oh, but I've been here before. Okay. But it does say there's still stuff in here. And if the monster's gone, I can actually look around. But I don't need that. That's probably what I'm missing. Alright, so I gotta find, like, a game piece. Um, there's other places I can go on the first floor, too. I haven't been up here. Oh, but there's a save back there, too. Oh, but that's, that's a locked door. Oh, it was through the mezzanine. Okay. So I need to go this way. Jesus. Oh. He got impaled on one of the letters that was flying. And now he's stuck there. <coughs> Good for you, man. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, that... Then why does it say it's open? I don't know. Um... So I guess I go through the rear staircase. Oh, there she is. This said like outdoor access, I think. Can't take those. <coughs> I do have like a million shotgun rounds. That's locked. Oh, there's the game piece. FG high. It's locked. Then I start brushing my teeth. Get every single part of your mouth covered. Okay. So I got the game piece. Which, that's huge. K. 
Cause that, um... Sometimes we would swap our arms, then... <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, where's the rec room? Kitchen. That works. Alright, now we're ready to play the board game. But we will do that in the next one. So thanks for watching. I'll see you then.